वेलकम स्टार्टिंग विथ वेरी बेसिक एंड इम्पॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन व्हाट इज सेटल प्लेट एयर मॉनिटरिंग इन फार्मास्यूटिकल इंडस्ट्री सेटल प्लेट मॉनिटरिंग इज ए मेथड फॉर असेसिंग द नंबर ऑफ एयरबॉर्न माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिजम्स दैट सेटल ऑन ए सरफेस ओवर ए स्पेसिफाइड पीरियड ऑफ टाइम सेटल प्लेट मॉनिटरिंग यूज फॉर एनालिसिस ऑफ माइक्रोबल कंटेमिनेशन इन द एयर एंड फॉर पर्सनल मॉनिटरिंग This one is very frequently asked question. Question is what is the recommended exposure time for settle plates in grade A and B areas? UGMP Annex One suggests exposing settle plates for up to four hours unless shorter durations are validated for specific processes. How often should settle plate monitoring be performed? UGMP Annex One requires frequent monitoring, typically during every production batch in. critical areas and at defined intervals in lower grade areas what are the acceptable microbial limits for settle plates in grade a areas according to eu gmp annex 1 the action limit is 1 cfu that is colony forming units in grade a areas for a 4 hour exposure period how should settle plates be handled after exposure According to USP Chapter Number Triple One Six, plates should be immediately covered, labeled, and transported aseptically to prevent contamination during transfer. Can setter plates be used in isolators? Direct answer is yes. As per UGMP Annex One, setter plates can monitor isolators, but placement must not interfere with critical operations. How should setter plates be placed in clean rooms? ISO 14644-1 recommends positioning plates in locations most representative of air quality such as near critical operations and air flow paths What actions should be taken if settle plate results exceed alert limits As per FDA's aseptic processing guidance an investigation should be initiated reviewing cleaning practices HVAC performance and personnel activities Very important question what are the key steps for settle plate monitoring step 1 preparing agar plates step 2 exposing plates step 3 incubation and fourth very important step counting and identification very important question what are the limits for microbial contamination during area qualification you can refer below table from ugmp annex 1 for limits for microbial contamination during area qualification What are maximum action limits for viable particle contamination as per UGMP Annex One? You can refer below table for maximum action limits for viable particle contamination as per UGMP Annex One. Can setter plates be used in grade D areas? Direct answer is yes. UGMP Annex One allow setter plate monitoring in grade D areas with limits set at less than or equal to 100 cfu as alert and less than or equal to 200 cfu as action per 4 hours what type of media is commonly used in settle plates for monitoring usp chapter number 3116 recommends using triptych soy agar that is tsa with added neutralizers like lecithin and polysorbate for microbial recovery Can settle plates be reused for multiple times? Direct answer is no. USP Chapter Number Triple One Six specifies single use per exposure to avoid cross contamination and ensure accurate results. How are settle plates incubated after exposure? USP Chapter Number Triple One Six recommends dual incubation, that is, twenty to twenty five degrees Celsius for two to three days for fungi and. 30 to 35 degrees celsius for 2 to 3 days for bacteria which guidelines are commonly used for setting limits for settle plate monitoring usp chapter number 797 usp chapter number 3116 and iso 14698 are the guidelines that are used commonly for setting limits for settle plate monitoring how the placement of settle plate is done Exposed plates at strategic locations, example near critical operations, equipment or personal pathway, 
प्लेस प्लेट्स एट डेजिग्नेटेड हाइट्स बेस्ड ऑन ऑपरेशनल स्टैंडर्ड्स एग्जाम्पल नियर वर्किंग सर्फेसेस और एयर फ्लोज इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन हाउ द रिजल्ट आर इंटरप्रिटेड फ्रॉम सेटल प्लेट मॉनिटरिंग फर्स्ट कॉलोनी फार्मिंग यूनिट्स और सी एफ यू द नंबर ऑफ कॉलोनी फार्मिंग यूनिट्स पर प्लेट इज काउंटेड एंड कंपेयर टू एस्टेब्लिश एक्शन लिमिट्स सेकेंडली माइक्रोवेल आइडेंटिफिकेशन आइडेंटिफाइड माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिजम्स आर इवेल्युएटेड फॉर देयर पोटेंशियल इम्पैक्ट ऑन प्रोडक्ट क्वालिटी एंड पेशेंट सेफ्टी वॉट आर द बेनिफिट्स ऑफ यूजिंग सेटल प्लेट एक्सपोजर मेथड फर्स्ट एडवांटेज इट प्रोवाइड्स Early detection of microbial contamination. Secondly, it helps to identify potential sources of contamination, and it verifies the effectiveness of cleaning and disinfection procedures. Which companies offer settled plates that meet international standards and regulations? Some companies offer settled plates that meet international standards and regulations, including UGMP regulations, FDA's. Aseptic guidance and USP chapter number triple one six. The company names are Millipore Sigma, Sigma Aldrich, and Merck Millipore. What are the common root causes for settled plate excursion? First, environmental factors. It includes HVAC system performance, air flow, temperature, and humidity. Secondly, personnel. Evaluate governing procedures and operator behavior. And third, important cleaning and disinfection. assess cleaning efficiency and rotation of disinfectants don't forget to like comment and share subscribe to channel for more videos related to our pharmaceutical industry